Uh, midday video. I don't do these very often, but we had such a wonderful move. I thought I'd talk about some of the stuff that's happening here. The trade of the day was Boeing. Uh, a massive gap and run up in this uh, secondary uh, channel situation. Uh, I saw this last night. I looked at this volume profile. I saw that we were we very extended on the daily here on our volume profile coming into the uh, uh, Fed new all the news today, and uh, so I did get the Boeing puts or Boeing calls, and it was a wonderful the my biggest uh, gainer of the day. Okay, and I see continuation now. Uh, we are probably definitely coming back to the three. 3862 area that's just the neutral position for the year so this may actually get that before the week is out uh these um 330 calls were up over a thousand percent just a little while ago they've come back in just a little bit but amazing uh, returns on boeing next on my list here uh hopefully it doesn't take too long to load here or i'll have to stop the video <sighs> okay, Amazon. Uh, some of these out of the money calls were just on fire today. Four or five hundred percent on just about everything uh, for Amazon. Uh, the volume for the control was right here as of yesterday for the yearly. So I wasn't nearly as confident uh, for a long position. But um, I know a lot of people in the trading rooms that I'm in. Uh, they were loaded to the boat to Amazon, uh, and congratulations, especially to AJ, who I know for a fact he was he made uh, like sixteen thousand dollars today on Amazon alone. So uh, uh, congratulations, and uh, then uh, some other people took some Google. Uh, it's not up that much today, but yeah, uh, you can see uh, three hundred. 50% return on Google here. Uh, basically, it's uh, still in it, and it's back to the uh, uh, yearly value point of control today. So it had a nice responsive move back into the accepted value uh, on the uh, volume profile. And then we had uh, the other company, Home Depot, had a nice little bid today. And then Give me one second here. Let's get her loaded. Hopefully, it won't take too long. And you see, it was on an ex another extreme on your profile. So we before weeks in, we will probably see the 172, 74 area on Home Depot uh, most assuredly. And, and Microsoft, which is just a beast, and like I mentioned in my nightly video, is probably going to be the first major tech stock to hit new 52-week highs. If this market uh, strength continues, look at this. Look at that run up in Microsoft there. So uh, it is pushing that we have a secondary distribution pattern here. It is pushing out above that. So uh, 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 just keep that one in mind. Uh, I'd much rather be down here heading into the volume profile instead of pushing out above the volume profile in a slightly bearish market. And that's what we have been in, and we are still uh, got a lot of damage above. So this is not one that I I really feel comfortable pushing to the upside because of all the overhead inventory uh, in the markets. Okay, and uh, let's see here, is there any others? Uh, oh yeah, Salesforce. You got your big returns on on uh, on CRIM because of the earnings, and then Apple. And I was in Apple today. There were some really good percent returns in Apple today. And uh, looky here, you see this the, this double channel? Uh, you could buy in here yesterday, and it rallied right up to the bottom of this channel into this second, in this, uh, it, it, well, basically a third, well, a fourth, fourth distribution pattern. But we are putting in a lot of value down in this area here. And this is from a historical uh, perspective. So, you know, it was a, uh, to me, it was a no-brainer to uh, get a rally back up to the bottom, to the very least, the bottom of the channel here. And that's what we got today. And uh, it was a very good trade. So, uh, I hope some of you guys got the Boeing and got the Amazon and, and even the Apple. Uh, all those I have were, was discussing yesterday. 
and uh, good luck, and hopefully we can continue this rally into the end of the week. See you later.